Hello and welcome back to Ice and Fire Season 2 Episode 3. Welcome back to the series. We are back, as I just said, in Episode 3. Um, anyways, uh, we are back here <laughs> at the Desert Temple where we left off. I have been back home uh, to empty out my inventory and I have gone back here. And now I am just chopping down these trees. This is... Douglas Furlock. Um, I'm probably butchering that name, but the wood looks pretty, and I want it. No idea if it has anything special to it. Probably not, but it looks really cool, and I want it. And I want a few saplings of this. Plus, I need some dirt. So, okay. Um, hmm, that's convenient. Not those bunnies always. They, they always die from fall damage. <laughs> Did it drop a rabbit's foot by any chance? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Big oof. Alright, but ultimately we are here to get Oh dear, that's loud. Uh, no, I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna no. We are here to get dirt because we need dirt back at the pyramid because we live in a desert and you can't really grow plants or farmland. Or farm animals for that matter in a desert without dirt and water and green stuff so that is what we will be doing we need some dirt I want to explore a little bit of this direction uh, just because I'm curious of the terrain and what may be there um, but I, I think I'm going to go for like maybe two stacks of dirt or something like that two stacks three stacks or something I think that is going to be a pretty good amount also what's this gray mushroom Hmm. Mushroom stew. Interesting. Cool. I shall leave that here. Um, but yes, I think I will break these two shovels basically, and then we shall uh, ride on horse. Let me know of a name for the horse, by the way. Ooh, saplings. Perfect. Let me know a name for the horse. Uh, I've forgotten to ask about that. He does not have a horse yet. Uh, he does not have a name yet. So let me know your suggestions down below in the comments right now. Uh, but yes, let me get a bunch of dirt here, and uh, we'll see how much we end up with when I'm done with these shovels. Alright, that is exactly three stacks of dirt, four uh, weird saplings, five. Didn't I see another one? Must have been the bunny. Um, Alright, what is this? Wait, apricot? Wait. Whoa, wait, can I? Okay, please tell me that I can get the sapling if I take this wood. Fruit log? Please tell me I get a sapling by taking this wood. Please tell me. I want an apricot tree. I want that tree so bad. The sun is going down soon. Come on. Give me a sapling. Quick. <laughs> Quickly. I don't have all day. Horse, where on earth are you going? Get back here. Uh. Okay. This could be... Oh, wait. One sapling. One apricot sapling. Yes. I don't know why I'm so excited, but I just really want this fruit tree. Okay, cool. <laughs> uh, okay, we must go before the sun settles. I want to see what is over here. Now watch, that's not going to be anything at all. Um, ocean. Okay. The forest continues even further. Okay. Hmm. I don't think there is much to come after. This is a really bad place to be on a horse if there were to spawn a dragon. Um, I could not be in a... Okay. <laughs> I could not be in a worse uh, scenario if we find a dragon at this point in time and it starts hunting us. Um, or a sea serpent for that matter. I almost forgot those actually. What do we have over here? Please, come on. Just get me over here. Another forest. Hmm. Is that purple logs? Are we getting... Also, what's this? Tall, mystical gray flower. Okay, not interested right now. But... These trees does look interesting. I just don't know if... We can manage to get a log in time. Uh, a sapling. I shall try. Plain log? 
That's interesting. You'd think it has would have another name. Oh, it has multiple branches. <laughs> okay. I see how this is going. Uh, it's not too wild, though. It's better than the uh, vanilla... Okay, well, this tree is strong. It went through the mountain and everything. Huh. Talk about willpower. <laughs> oh, wait. Did I just get the... I just got the sapling. Okay. Um, We're done here. <laughs> I don't need... I only need one, I think. All right. Perfect timing as well, because we need to head home. The sun is setting, and I do not want to be out here in the dark. Horse, where on earth do you think you're going? Ooh, two saplings. Perfect. All right, let us head home uh, before it gets dangerous, and we shall... Got another sapling. Okay, this is the day of the saplings, apparently. Oh, dear. <laughs> let me get home, and uh, we'll be safe from the monsters out here when it gets dark, and we'll start work on the garden thing that I want to make. Well, I'm gonna at least call it a very small farm area thing. Also, uh, do these cactus drop like nothing? They drop absolutely nothing. All right, that, that, that's fine. I was kind of hoping for a, at least like one Mermix uh, colony to be in this desert. That would have been pretty cool to have Mermixes as our neighbors and eventually as our friends. Um, but, oh dear, the hunters are out. Oh no, leave me alone. There's so many. Hmm. That's interesting. Where is my pyramid? Where's, where's home? I'm just happy they don't have bows. Look at them. Okay, that's that's a bit... Oh, they do have bows. Okay, that that's a bit messed up. <laughs> that's a bit messed up. <laughs> I think I may have to tweak their spawn rate because... Um, hmm. No other mob spawned except for that guy. All right, we have an invader here waiting for us to get home. I do not want to get stabbed in the back. Okay, uh, we're good. Sleep, sleep, sleep before it's too late. All right, it is daytime. Horse is going to wander uh, for right now in a way. I just want to get rid of... I heard some zombies over here. Yeah, there you are. Please be gone. I do not want you here because you're making noise. Right, so I want to make two things here. I want to make a green area for food, of course, and also make a safe place for you, because if that happens, I'm going to be upset. I can't lose you. <laughs> okay, so he's going back there again, isn't he? I'm not risking that. Be gone. All right, so I have a bit of an idea. I don't know if I will be able to do this, but I have a bit of an idea. I want the grass to kind of spread from the water and up here, eventually going all the way up to uh, the pyramid. And I guess I should have emptied this wood in the base, but whatever. I want to place down this dirt, but of course it has to replace the... Wait, what am I doing? It has to replace the sand here, so... If we just first do something like this, and I'm actually not sure if we will be able to get grass on this, I just thought of that. I will have to, oh dear. I will have to make a bridge, dirt bridge from that all the way over here so that this can potentially spread. Uh, okay, that's gonna be, that's gonna be a bit annoying. Annoying, but not impossible. So now the grass can theoretically eventually spread all the way over here and I just have to basically do this all the way over to the dirt that we actually want. Like this, like that. There we go. Uh, that should in theory work. So now I can continue putting dirt here at the beach where I actually want it. Oh, that's so annoying. That's gonna be a pain. So something like that and then start removing this and placing normal dirt in instead. And I'm thinking maybe having like some water running from here and down through the dirt. I think that would look absolutely amazing. So maybe if I just Put in the water now, actually. So if I want the water there, I obviously don't have a bucket right now. But if the water were to come down like this, maybe something like this. Oh, okay, we're gonna continue with the hand. To here, and then... I 
something actually, yeah, like that. And I'm gonna need a shovel for this. And a bucket. Okay, we're gonna spend some iron. And I'm also making an iron shovel because I refuse to dig the rest with my hands. Alright, so with a bucket, I can now do this. And yeah, I just want it to basically float down. And then we place another source there and have it stable all the way until we end up over here. So place one here. And then we place another. I should have made two buckets, but I want to preserve the iron like that and then like so like so I don't want it to run like a stream uh, all the way down to this bit and then let it run out and then have dirt all around that all right I think that is a pretty good plan uh, I guess it's time to, <laughs> to find out. Okay, let me start digging. All right, so that is all the dirt I had available. Um, I didn't have more dirt than that, so huh, I thought I would have enough. Well, it, to be honest, it, it wasn't that huge amount. So yeah, but anyways, uh, I think this is going to be pretty good. That is when the grass actually manages to spread over. Um, so I'll have to sit in here AFK in between episodes, let the grass go over. But for now, I think this will do. I do want to convert all of this into dirt as well. And of course, all of this in front here, at least three or four blocks out. Um, but yeah, for now, I think this will do just fine. Next, I kind of want to clear an area out for the horse. And I was thinking doing it over there, but I think actually... I'm going to put down some of the sand that I've gotten and do it right in front of this um, tower pillar thing right here because I just so I just I have so much sand and I really don't need this much not at the moment anyway so I think placing some of it down is definitely not going to hurt anyone I think such an area should be all right now maybe we could actually use some of the new wood that we got from this see all the sand I don't need this much sand um, I want one of this. I definitely want uh, one of that. And these bushes for sure. And I would love to start growing some of this stuff as well. Next, um, oh yeah, sweet potato. I want some of that too. And industrial herbs. <laughs> um, now, wood, 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 wood. Do I have wood? Where do I have wood? Here, do I have wood? Um, yeah, I think we will use this wood right here. I could use this. Um, but that is very, very dark. So I think this wood right here is going to look the nicest as a, let me see, is this a recipe? Nope, that's a fence gate. Okay, we need two of those. Um, but yeah, I was going to say, especially as a fence, and I don't need that much. I think that should be able to cut it. I just don't trust my horse in the wild right now because yeah, cactus and yeah, nah. Uh, one, two, three, four. Oh, just one, two little, just one. Not good enough. Not uh, annoying. It just couldn't match up, could it? Um, I could extend it to over here. That would probably be the nicest. Hmm. Yep, I'm going to. He needs a big space, and eventually he will also get a bunch of dirt and water uh, around him. <laughs> <laughs> but for now, I think this right here will do. Now I just need two more, and we have it done for now. And good enough, I think. 
for now anyway. That is just to keep him safe and eventually we will make a nicer area for him. Maybe he can even, maybe we'll even fence this entire area in. How about that? Maybe we'll do that. Anyways, uh, da, da, da. way too close for all that. No, no, just uh, no. Get in here where it's safe. Yes, better, much better. And as I said, this grass, it's getting there. It's moving slowly, um, <laughs> very slowly, mind you. All right, let's place, um, okay, so I want the plain sapling, I think, here, right there. I want it um, here. Nope, wait, there. I think right there. This apricot sapling, I'm thinking eh, up here, right there. Uh-huh, I like that. Now I need a hoe. I feel like I said that very weirdly. Hmm, I, I'm not sure I like that. That that sounded weird. So for the crops, um, I guess along here will work. 25 slots, yeah. Wheat, sweet potato, and soybean and corn. So all of that we will be eventually be able to fill out this entire area with. So that is going to be amazing. And these bushes, I will place them here. And of course, the strawberry ones right there. Now the question is, do I have any bone meal? I think, did I get a lot of bone from this? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I just want to see this stuff uh, actually grown. Like the apricot tree and the, um, the trio there. And I assume the apricot will get apricots, right? Yeah, it says 0% growth right up there at the top left hand corner. So that is really cool. And ah, one, one, one bone meal. Okay. I like this place. Now, as I said, we'll just need to wait for the grass. Um, but I really want this episode ready for tomorrow. So I think we'll see that then in the next episode. And I think I'll have to try and get some more dirt either in the next episode or in between. We'll have to find out. But anyways, another thing that I really wanted to make, let me just get rid of all this, was to make this right here, the Eisenfire Bestiary, right here. So now we have made that, but I also really want to make that so that we are also going to make that, 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 as many that's. Bestiary Lectern. And I'm gonna place it right over here. Boom. Sweet. Now we can actually use the manuscripts that we get in here. Uh, I don't know what to get though. That's the thing. See, so I guess we need everything. So I feel, oh, three manuscripts. Oh, that has become expensive. Okay. Well, there it is. <laughs> um, and I feel like for this, I want, mm, I want more open room here. I want a lot more open room, but I'm just scared that bad guys will start spawning, which I won't be happy with. Um, wait, how is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, oh, one, two. Okay, yeah, I guess that makes sense. There we go. Are there any of this that is light level? Yeah, there's a light level here. That's seven. Maybe like this. Nine, ten, nine, ten, eight, nine. I think we're good on the light level. Sweet. I think that is good. I like this. Question though, is it possible to grow? It is possible to bone meal this. Also, oh, that's cool. Is this blue? No, this is blackberries. Oh. Oh, I don't have any. Okay. Well, that's that's still cool. Look at that. I'm just I'm gonna keep that just for the looks of it. Yeah. Wait, can I then use bone meal on the leaves? Hold on. I wanna I wanna see this. <laughs> the night has passed. Let's have a fun time. That message. Haven't appeared before.
That message has not appeared before. I'm generally I'm, I'm actually scared. <laughs> Night time has passed. Let's have a fun time. That has never shown up before. All right. Anyway, I'm just going to put this back now. That was so weird. Okay. Anyway, can we bone meal this? Oh, we can. But only that specific leaf. Look at that. Look at that. Fully grown. Oh, okay. That's cool. So if I right click it. Wait, where did, where did my apricot go? Come back here. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> and we can put it in jam. We can make apricot pie. Or I can eat it just like this. Mmm. Mmm. Cool. That is very, very awesome. I like this. All right, so I think we're running out of time for this episode, but I feel like we really got a lot of stuff done. Um, yeah, I don't know. And uh, in the next episode, I would of course love to get the grass all the way over here. It is slowly making its way over. That's going to be interesting. Excuse me, you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to be there. But like, just please. Yeah, thank you. How did he get in there? But yeah, in the next episode, I would love to expand this area. Of course, get uh, grass over here. Maybe explore a little bit more. But really, I want to get started with um, immersive engineering. I know it's not Eyes of Fire, but I really love this mod. And I would love to get started with it. Um, I need to refresh on what to do first. But there is like so much um, that you can do with this. And... It's going to be pretty cool if we could get some stuff set up. So I'm possibly going to excavate some down here. Either in the next episode or in between. Uh, we'll have to see. Also, I need to fix these ladders because they're impossible to get up at. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I really hope you have enjoyed. Now, just a reminder, if you want access to the Eyes of Fire Season 2 mod pack, become a patron down below in the description. It supports me a ton. You can get access to it with just $1 a month of supporting and it helps me out a ton. So yeah, if you want access to as a fast season to my pack, there you go. Link down below in the description. But anyways, hope you have enjoyed. If you did and haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe. I'm trying to reach 3000 subscribers before the end of the year. Can we do it? It's up to you guys. So if you enjoyed my content, be sure to do so. And of course, leave a like and I hope to see you in the next episode. Have a wonderful day and goodbye. Con te lana o eruta así, Zapu o es fluic ni maya, no estaban tin ni